Hey guys, today I am doing a incredibly overdue video of this adorable pull-up that you see here. It's a custom Rolf the Muppet pull-up and there's a big story behind this. Um, so when I went to Puddle just this past June, I found out that many of my fabulous doll friends were very sneaky and they got together and they decided to put together a custom doll just for me. And so at Puddle, they actually presented it to me and I was completely taken off guard. It was a surprise. I had no idea how many people were involved in it. And I've been pretty sick these last few weeks, so I haven't been able to do um, a video of this doll that really does it justice. So right now she is wearing her second outfit, uh, but I will change her in a second so you could see her in her full Rolf the Muppet uh, regalia. I won't go into the whole why I love Rolf the Muppet thing again. You can watch other videos, but you know, I didn't even realize that they knew Rolf was my favorite Muppet, but I must say it like all the time and not even, I'm like that annoying person that's like, do you want to hear about Rolf the Muppet and why he's my favorite? I must do that like all the time because I don't even know it. Anyway, so let me talk about this wonderful, gorgeous doll and then I have to, to show you everything else that came with her because she came with a haul of stuff. So first of all, this wig, I believe is a Leak World wig and it was donated by my friend Tess, I believe. The outfit is from one of my BFFs, Emily. She has an Etsy shop that's just on fire right now, but I love that this outfit has the little paw prints on it. So cute. And the face up, first of all, she's brown hair and brown eye, just like me. You guys know I love that. Um, so the face up was done by my friend Kelly. I love how she looks like the little girl next door. She is so, so cute. She has just the most subtle uh, face up and these big brown eyes. And because Kelly knows I love me some colored eyelids, she made these gorgeous dark brown lids as well. All right, so give me just a minute and I am going to put her in her original outfit so you can see uh, the handmade Rolf costume and then I'll show you the rest of the stuff. Okay, so here is Rolf. Such a girly name, isn't it, Rolf? Here is Rolf in her handmade costume. So cute, you guys. So this is a onesie that was, I believe, handmade by Karen. And it is really, really true to the Muppet. Uh, the big floppy ears, uh, there's snaps in the front. There's even a hole in the back for all of her beautiful hair. And then she also comes with these little boots. She is so cute, you guys. I seriously, whenever Brock and Kelly came up and gave her to me, I was just like, like, why? Why are you guys doing this? <laughs> super, super cool, fun surprise that I was not expecting. All right, so let me show you all the other stuff because there's some really fun things. So first of all, Kelly, I've mentioned her before. She is super, um, Super talented, she's super crafty. And I know that she actually covered this box with musical notes. And as you might know, Rolf is a piano player. But inside the box came a couple of things. The Muppets movie, which I love, I love this movie. And It's Not Easy Being Green, the book with Kermit on the front. I love Kermit too. And then I also noticed that Emily threw in a second little skirt and this one has little dogs on it. So this is adorable. So thanks, you guys. And if that wasn't enough, oh, but there's more. So a lot of the people in, in this uh, secret group put together a scrapbook. Let me show this to you with my name on it. And it has all of these notes. I'll show some of them to you. This is from my friend Sianora. I think she's in the US, but look how beautiful this artwork is. And there is a poem in here, my little doll. And then check this out, you guys. It says, thank you, Angela. And it's got notes from Avery and Emily and Amber, Timmy, Colin. I just, I think, when I started to read these notes in the airport leaving Chicago, that's from Jeanette, that's when I started to lose it. 
I'm sitting here like a nerd going, really losing my cool because some of these are just so heartfelt. Ooh, and then on the back here, Kelly added a, uh, a list of everybody who had helped. And I know there's some other little pieces that are still on their way, so I can't thank you guys enough. And then lastly, I shouldn't say lastly, um, this actually came early, and this is from my friend Charon. She put this together because she knew that, I don't know if you can see it, that Mint Alice is my favorite stock pull-up. And when it showed up, she was kind of sneaky about what it was for. She just said, oh, I just wanted to send it, but it turns out that it was part of this whole project with this custom doll. So I wanted to thank you guys so much for thinking of me. This was so awesome. And I can't wait to see what adventures Rolf's gonna go on. We'll talk soon.